Hello, welcome back to the channel. So today is a unboxing um, of a um, item that I received from Your Creative Studio. Um, she sent me this um, box of goodies to try out, so I thought I would do a unboxing of it. Um, so let me share with you what is in here. She's got this really fun paper that's sealed around it. So, let's see, here's the card. Your Creative Studio. Okay, I'll link the information um, down below. Um, but let's take a look at what's in here. So, from what I can see and from what I know about the companies, they have a lot, they um, are, have a lot of vintage um, stuff. And so, and I think, I can't remember if it's a prescription, subs, prescription, subscription box. Um, but I'll, I'll have the stuff, the information left below. So first off, there's this really fun pack of tickets. That is so cute. And of course, you know how you love tickets. Oh man, and look at all these that you get. Wow, there's a whole bunch here. All different colors and designs. Ooh, these will be fun. And you can either leave them together or tear them apart and use them. Those are very pretty. Floral illustrations. Look at the, oh, there's 36 pieces in this one. Okay, so there's those. Okay, let's see what else there is. Oh, these are pretty. Happy Burning Fire. So these are a sticker. It looks like it's a vellum. And so, and I think she said this one she sent to me was a botanicals or something. Um, I think that's what she said. So, um, I'll have to make something with this. But look at all these pretty things. There's 40 pieces in here. And so they're real, they're real small. So they'll be fun to use. And I think they're out of, it looks like on, out of, like out of a vellum type thing. So really pretty. Flamingos and florals. Really cute. Okay, then next, there's this pack, and this looks like stamps. Let's check this out. So this one, I'm not sure if it says how many pieces. I don't think this one says how many pieces, but, oh yeah, they're stamps. <clears throat> and so there's four in a thing, and of course you could leave it like that, or tear them apart and use them separately. And it looks like there's a variety of them. And... So there's a couple different um, designs of those. So those are really pretty. Just put those back there. Okay, and then there is this paper ephemera. How cute is that? That cute little toucan. Okay, I don't know how many's in here. But let's. I'm not, I won't go through each piece, but I'll just kind of shuffle through a little bit so we can kind of get an idea. Some florals, some pineapples, palm leaves, some more florals. Oh, <laughs> look at that cute little, like, gecko. Oh, that's cute. Um, another toucan. More palm leaves. Looks like there's some, um, I'm dropping them all over. Some more flamingos. Cute. Cute stuff. Okay, let me get this back in the pack. So if you guys are into uh, a vintage style, this, these are make some fun things to add to. Not only, you can only, not only make scrapbook pages out of this, but um, this is probably more, um, lots of things to add to like, um, you know, like travel notebooks, um, you know, those kind of things. This is cute. Oh, this is a pad. Oh, and there's all kinds of different designs here. So those are cute. Okay, so there's that. Okay, next it says, this is a stamp, a cling stamp. Okay, cool. Let's see what this is. <clears throat> 
so we got a flamingo and we have a um a leaf so cute so those are some cute cute um cling stamps <clears throat> So all you're going to do on a cling stamp is just take your, uh, take a, a glass block. <coughs> and then you just kind of peel this off, stick it on. Okay. And you can, um, uh, <laughs> what am I trying to say? <laughs> um, let me, where is it? have a bunch of clean stamps so okay I'm having I'm having a senior moment I'm trying to remember how how to attach these um, to um, to stamp with them because you can put them in your put them on a glass block you can put them in your stamp like a you know like your misty um, so I'm, but I'm drawing a blank on how to do this. If nothing else, I would just put a little, uh, glue dot on there and just stick it to my stamp, snap it to my stamp block. And then that way it would stay. So when you, you know, flipped it over and stuff, but really cute. I like that. So you guys are probably thinking, oh my gosh, she doesn't even know how to stamp. <laughs> Don't ever get old, you guys. Oh my gosh. Because I, I draw blanks all the time. Here's another cling stamp. So this one is the toucan and the pineapple. Look how cute those are. So cute. And I don't know why I'm drawing a blank on it because I guess because I haven't done it for so long. And um yeah, I don't, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why else. Because <laughs> uh, I have a whole bunch of cling stamps in my in my stash. So I'm not sure what this is. It's a, it comes in a, like a little matchbox kind of thing. So these are, oh. So these are some more little, looks like sticker type things. Let's see if we can get it open. So we got like some ticket shapes. So there's all kinds of little um, like ephemera pieces here. Some ovals, some florals. Those are cute. Oh my gosh, you got there. You get a lot in this in this kit. This one says wash or masking tape. And it says washi. <clears throat> Let's check this out. So in here we have this pretty, um, it's kind of a marble looking um, brownish color. It's got, oh, it's got, and it's got leaves on it. That's really cute. Okay, so that's washi. And then down here we have um, some more pieces. Let's see what these are. Okay, it's in this cute little envelope. I love the envelope, too. Ooh, I love that envelope. Okay, so in here we have a bunch of strips, like paper strips that you could use, you know, cut a border out of. You could just layer them up, like stamps, all kinds of fun things. So pretty. Love all the florals. Those are cute. Stamps. These look like they're probably the clear ones. Those are cute. Love those. Okay, so you get all those. I don't know how many are there, but it looks like a lot. And I don't can't see a um, an amount on that package. So I can't tell you, but there's a lot there. Okay, then we have this. And these look like stickers. Yeah, and they're like a clear type sticker see so cute two cans and some florals really pretty this one says masking tape so this looks like a probably like a sheet of um, I don't know. 
with this. Is it like a sheet of washi? Ooh, it is like tissue paper. Oh my goodness, look how pretty that is. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So you get a few sheets of that. Okay, and then, looks like this might be the last one. And this is paper ephemera. It contains 24 sheets. Six sticker paper, six vellum paper, six art paper, six pattern paper. Use on your journal spreads, scrapbooks, tags, and much, much more. So cute. Oh yeah, and you could die cut these. Use them in your pages. Yeah, these are really great for journals and daily. Oh, and some of it, yes. It, it, well, I guess it said that, duh. But some of them were out of vellum. Look at that. So cute. So, so cute. A whole bunch of different ones. She said, like it says, papers and vellums. Um, very cute. Okay, this is a really fun, neat set. So, I'm looking forward to making something out of this. I have not created anything that's very um, vintage lately. I used to do almost all vintage um, until I kind of switched a little bit to more of a clean and simple. Well, clean and simple kind of, but then I also love layering. So, anyway, we'll see what I come up with. To make with this, I will link all of the info down below and um, come back and see what I create with this. It should be fun. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry, I'm still on a blank on the cling stamps. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, but we will figure it out. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Your Creative Studio, for sending me all this to try out. I love it. And, um, yeah, I'll see you guys back with what I make. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye-bye.